As Utah prepares to potentially host the 2034 Winter Olympics, the state faces a challenge, improving air quality before the global event. The International Olympic Committee doesn't require hosts to meet specific air quality metrics or particle measurements, but it does demand hosts contribute to its targets of reducing its greenhouse gas emissions. So the Winter Games' potential return to Utah is being seen as an opportunity to push lawmakers to take substantial actions to address air quality. However, despite Utah being the preferred candidate, the legislature has yet to propose bills directly addressing air quality with less than a week before the 2024 session begins. Some lawmakers say they feel little urgency to address the problem this session. However, bills pertaining to air quality are usually proposed during the latter half of the six-week general session, and that could be the case again this year. Some anticipate Utah lawmakers will propose bills incentivizing electric vehicles, promoting renewable energy through solar panels, and improved insulation, among other things. Utah Governor Spencer Cox also allocated $125 million in funding for clean air and transportation initiatives in the budget for 2025, which includes funding for a pilot program to encourage use of public transit, but it will need the legislature's approval.